Russia is leading the medal table. So here we have Imarishuli in white and Moherman in blue. Imarishuli takes a left handed grip straight away, which Moherman blocks out. Drops him down and carry on in Nevaza. Going for strangle. But Imarishuli managed to stand up. Cross grip from Imarishwi tries to go for left side in Makikomi. And again, the Dutch guy trying to get a score immediately in Nawaza with Putin on a Shimawaza. Left side grip again from Imarishwi. Seems to be a dominating left-handed grip and is pressuring Mormon. We have to watch the edge now. He's got a strong grip. Imerli has got a strong grip but very weak attacks. He needs to put more effort into those attacks. I need to block the sleeve in order to get a score from those attacks. And he receives a sheet oil as well. Going for the left again. Mormon goes first this time. And now Imerish really got his left side his grip back, pressuring Mormon. There is that grip again. You see, it looks like a good, strong grip. Left-sided attack from Mormon, which Imerlish really managed to counter. And uh, the Georgian coach is claiming a Yuko for them. Again, goes for the left-sided grip. Now switches to the right, pressuring Mormon on the right side this time. Mohamed attacks on the left, doesn't work, carries on. Mohamed gone in for left-sided Uchimata, which Imerish really stepped out of and he carried on with an Ouchi and a Kosotogake. But neither of them work and they left the area. And Imerish really received a Shido as well. Again, strong right side grip for both opponents. Kosoto from Mormon. Kosoto Gaka, but Imelishvili managed to twist out of it. A minute and a half left, cross grip. It's going to cause him another Shido. He's not attacking, he just have the cross grip, but he's not attacking. And the When you have a cross grip, you immediately have to attack. And that's the third Shido. That is a very interesting throw. What Imelish really have done. Um, he got a Wazari for that. So he had a cross grip. And Mama was trying to escape. Imelish really wrapped his other arm around underneath. And lifted him up. Throw him in the direction of Urenage with a different grip. And now Mormon is riding Navaza again, trying to get the Shimavaza. It seems to be on. It seems to me that it's pretty much around the neck. I doubt that Imarish really will tap out. I thought so. It's not like the Georgian will tap out. They will pass out before they tap out. So we still have a Wazari for Imerlish really and the free Shido as well. So he needs to be careful not getting any more Shidos. Again, left sided attack. Mormon blocks it well and he goes straight in Nunavaza once more. Again, going for Strangle. And managed to. 
and managed to get the Ipon at the end. He knew he would get it, he believed in it, even though there was only under 30 seconds on the board, and he was Wazari down, he carried on in the Waza, and he knew he's going to get it, he's going to get the strangle, and so he did. So it's going to be Mark Mormon going through to the next round.